Hey up everyone, and welcome back to the north for the next episode of Goblin Stone with our little wholesome goblin lair and friends. So we've got a few more goblins who have joined the fray, as it were, and we have since rescued our fellow orc friend, who has now taken us to the hinterlands, I do believe. I think we can now access the next big area, so we are going to be going to check that out today. Let me do some quick introductions for all the other goblins. There has been an update to the game, so a few things work a little bit differently now. I'm not 100% of how it all works but we will figure it out together. First thing I did notice is that, generally speaking, the overarching structure of, like, the barracks list is quite different, so you can see, like, way more information than we used to. So we can actually see, like, body, mind, and spirit, what everything's been equipped with, what, like, their rank is, and, like, what how many souls we get if we, like, cast them off. The, uh, the barracks itself is still a little bit broken, in, from my perspective, but it shows, still shows, like, the 16 out of 18, but it still shows 12 here, so if you try and bring people in, it says it's full, even though it's definitely not full. So, there is still a bit of a bug for that, so much so that I had to dismiss a random person who didn't, who wasn't actually like a, a submit goblin, just so I could get the hunter in, just so we could see what he's like. And that's going to be Whale Piper. We've also got Frongler. We've also got Anishi, who is going to be a god as well. I think it was like one of the... I think it's a bit weird. It says 12 and 18, but it still gives me access to 18. So I think there's something kind of wrong there. But I guess I'll just live with it. I, I would like to build like the next uh, guild, but I do need 15 wood as well. Unless this guy just sells it. Do you sell, like, woods? Do you sell a lot of wood? You sell eight woods. Um, I don't know how much I have. I wish it did say, like, you have X amount already. That would be quite handy. But it doesn't. So, oh, no, I have eight. I have eight. I'm being dumb. Don't worry, I'm being dumb. He doesn't have any to give. Fair enough. That's fair enough. What are our quests currently? So, Ancestors Hold level 3, upgrade the war room and the campgrounds. I'm pretty sure I already upgraded the campgrounds, unless... We need to do it again, I guess. Let me have a look at a war room. How hard is it to upgrade the war room? I need 30 wood, 30 bone. That's, that's quite a bit. That's quite a bit. And then we also need to go follow the Orc to the Hinterlands. That's fine. And then the Ancestor Hole level 3. That'll just be to do with souls. I've got 14 souls. I need how many? 20. I think I won't upgrade anything else with souls for the time being then. And I will just keep them to upgrade the Ancestor Hole just so we can get overarching upgrades. But without further ado, let's get a little group together and let's go check out the Hinterlands. It might be somewhere that kills us straight away. We'll see. Okay, so Chipper Bluff. These bluffs have not been explored for a very long time. Send out a scouting party to become reacquainted with them. That's fine. Ten bones, not bad either. We've got quite a lot of resources that can go there. There is a lot of different uh, slimes and stuff, so we're going to have to be interested about that. I feel like they've also changed how the audio works again, because the audio has once again changed in, like, volume and stuff, even though I, I haven't messed with it at all. So, it's a bit... <laughs> this, this game seems to be very to and fro with how they're updating it, but we'll see how it goes. It seems okay for the time being. Let's rock and roll. Let's get our party together. I'll try and bring in some, like, veterans as well as some, like, other people as well. This should do, so we're going to take some new people and some old people still. So we're going to take Anisha, we're going to take Sir Fred, we're going to take uh, Gaberxi, we're going to take Whale Piper to see how the Hunter works, and then Squidward, and then Twig. Let me get people's stuff set up and ready to go, because people aren't equipped as of yet, but that shouldn't be too hard to handle. Well, let's pan down a little bit and see how dangerous it actually is, eh? Hey, it looks, you know, looks like a forest to me. Um, where is everyone? All the goblins are- can you see them all having a fit here? So we've got- so Anishi's by himself, the rest of the goblins are currently off screen trying to join the fray. Hmm, maybe their update might have done something worse to the rest of the game, who knows. Uh, alright, I assume you guys will catch up. Oh, they just spawn- <laughs> They just- they just spawn out for now. Let's forget that happened, eh? I think there's still a lot of stuff they need to fix in the game, understandably. We just saw one example there. Right, is there anyone here who I could grab? Eight. Power of eight. Crudfester. Brute and flabby. Brute and flabby. Raid bonus two. Hmm. Sure, I'll choose Crudfester, although he will show up at the uh, fairgrounds. Fairgrounds? Campgrounds instead. I'll see if I can make room for him, because I might end up retiring just, like, a random goblin instead who has, like, really bad stats. There's not really much point in keeping him around. Right, what have I got? I've got a shrine or I've got a guru. I'm going to go guru. 
Let's get some of our abilities upgraded. If I can get some raider ones upgraded, that'd be good just because we've got two raiders with us. Um, or maybe... You know what? Any, any, any are good. But let me just see what they are. Uh, exterminate is good, but it's not... It's not that great in terms of... Ah, oh, you know what? Fine. Fine. Call my bluff game. Fine. Uh, Wakey Wakey is also amazing. Soul Gale. I do love upgrading Soul Gale, though. Is there a guard one? Intercept is really good. What's double shot? Ooh, I don't... You know what? You know what? I'm going to give it to the Hunter, because this is the first time we're bringing in a Hunter. So let's go... Let's go Hunter ability, just to see how it goes. There is something on the floor as well. Grab that. We need everything we can grab. Money and everything. Especially wood and bone? I think I need bone as well. That spider looks surprisingly different and scarier, because it's black and red instead of whatever the regular... Uh, color walls. Don't mind me, Mr. Spider. I'm just rummaging. Don't chase me. Get him! Surprised him! Got you! Oh yeah, that is, uh, a much bigger spitter than the regular spider, indeed. Well, I guess I can... 20% chance to stun. 100% armor damage and then stun. Smack him! Alright. I'll take it. So, Fred, wakey wakey! Oh my god, there goes down the red back. Fantastic start, Freddy. He is knackered, but... Who cares? He did a great job. Also sundered. Fantastic. Right, let's have a go hunter. Let's have a whale piper. So he's got chop. He's got beast, bear, and arrow. Target any foe. Deals 50% to a foe. If it's a beast, deal 120% instead. And then double shot, target two random foes. So if it went beast, bear, and arrow, that would just kill it, right? Sick! He's gonna, I think he's going to be quite useful in, in this area in general. What's your uh, resistance to stun like? Not good enough for Squidward. Squidward will put you on your back, my guy. Uh, Spirit Rush will be good. I could just blast. And freeze it. So what does Frozen do? Just the, just the mobilization, right? Well, Piper, don't worry about it. You're only poisoned a tiny bit. I mean, Beast Bane Arrow would make sense just to do, generally speaking, in this. And then that deals it to the... Rear foe. It's gonna take a bit of getting used to, I think. A bit of getting used to. Pretty damn cool, though. Pretty damn cool. I'd say that. And then she just bash it. Bash it. Bop it. Twist it. Do whatever you need to do. And then, so, Fred, you might just be able to... You won't, but you'll get it so close that it's not gonna matter. Because now... Got Berks, you can just finish it. Let's just go Sudden Strike. You'll never see it coming. Too fast for eyes. Cool. That was relatively all right for our first foray into the hinterlands. Although, keep your heads on a swivel, my goblin kind, because you never know what's coming next. Big bones? Nothing I can interact with those? Okay, fine, leave it. Just leave it. This place seems pretty straightforward, at least. What's this like? What's this? There's like a sparkly thing on the floor. Can I do anything with that? No, just, I'm just trying to be careful with it. Each foe has a 30 percent chance to gain slow at battle start. That's pretty decent. It's a 1 in 3. Add 4 power to 2 random weapons, though. That, mm, I can probably just interact with that, generally speaking. I'm just going to close our weapons. Screw it. In the shrine's blessing. Let's just do it. I'm doing it now. No take back, sees. It's done. Sorry. And now there is a blacksmith who, as we know, does screw up quite a bit. So we'll see how he does. Um... Hopefully, he does really well on the first one, because it's three, the and it can't fail. But uh, every time he does the second one... Oh no, it can fail. Hmm. All of a sudden, I'm not so sure about how I feel about that. Go on. Okay, that was successful. If I did, let's say, this one, it's now a one in four chance to fail. Oh, he did it! This, that's the first time. First time we've had a blacksmith which hasn't screwed up the second one. And I thought it was just a bug. I honestly did. Apparently not. Oh, shit. I almost didn't see my spider because it was so hidden in, like, the back. Unfortunately, it isn't surprise, so it might get the drop on us. We're going to have to see how it goes. Rattle, rattle! I'll take it. And then do we have... Wakey, wakey. That's a great, like, one, too. Oh, 
Especially when Sir Fred drops it like that. Right, gr let's go. Just, just a good chop. Just a good chop, you know? Chop, chop, indeed. Will Piper, can you finish it off? Would that kill it? I don't think it will, so let's just kill it, kill it. I don't think that would have been enough, even with, like, the double shot. It would have come close, I think, but not close enough. Lob it. Nice. That was, like, a decent amount of damage as well. And then Twig, if you want to just blast. Amazing. Fantastic work, team. Now everyone's a little bit tired, so the spider's probably going to get a go. That could have been worse, though. So I'm, I'm okay with that. Uh, Anishi, smash him. And then Sir Fred, like, with the follow-up, my guy. Actually, go Sun Strike. It doesn't matter if it doesn't give you uh, the old dash at Rooney. But that's all right. Gobberixie. Gobberixie? Go go Gobberixie. Gobberixie. I'm going Gobberixie. Grab that. Eh, money's money. I haven't seen anything else, like, glowing on the floor that I can see. It seems like a pretty straightforward, like, run. There is a tough battle coming. Everyone's, generally speaking, looking okay, though. But you never know what's coming with the battle. Big Wolf? Big Wolf on campus? Something of worth. Right, are you going to turn around and... Place. Go on, turn around. Turn, turn around. Stop looking at me like that. Go on, look away. We're not... We're just blind into the barrier. Get him, go, go. Okay, I still don't know how surprise works. <laughs> Maybe it's like an off chance. These walls look a bit stronger than the uh, regular wolves, don't they? What's your uh, resistance chance? 10, okay. Twatted. Right. Come on. Give me the... I've got sudden strike. Hmm. What's my crit chance? What's your armor like? One. Okay, let's just go chop for now. Didn't sunder. That's a lot of damage. Holy hell, that's a lot of damage. That wasn't a lot of damage. And then, unfortunately, the offset of that is obviously... Oh, man. I don't know. This, uh... This could be bad. It did say... I suppose it did say tough battle. I kind of got to give it that. It did say tough battle. I could shove it, and then it would go much further back. But we're so far... Try to stun that one. There isn't going to be, like, another person going for a while. I could soul gale them and push, and push them back back. God, we've got a while until it's our turn. At least it was an issue who is, like, a tank who's taking it on. Who's going to get there first? Rude. Very rude. Who's going to get there first? That's rough, buddy. That is rough going. Um, its defense is a bit better now, so let me intercept and put your armor up. That way you should be able to stop the next attack. And then, Gaberxi should be able to wipe... Oh, no, it's ran away now. Oh! Good lord. Right. With you. Giant, giant spider down. Now it's just the mahoosive wolves to deal with. What's Dung Trap? Set a trap with a 50% chance to activate when target takes damage. Once activated, deals 100% to the target and adjacent foes. Um. Sure. I don't quite understand what that's doing. I suppose that's my only... This trap failed, right? Okay. I still don't really... Get it? But, okay. Let's just roll the punches for now. It just keeps saying trap failed. I don't know if that's just looking at it for every, like, time he goes onto it, I guess. Oh, but then disappears because it was technically on that character. Right. What's your stun resistant? Not good enough, my son. Not good enough. And he got some health back. I keep forgetting about that big increase. Let's go Beast Bane Arrow. Let's just kill that one. I'm liking Hunter. I'm liking Hunter. I'm also liking how it works against beasts. It makes sense, doesn't it? Let's go Sun Strike. No crit this time, unfortunately. Squidward, it's all on you. Try and crit. 
And he will. I think this is the last wolf that didn't get um, stunned last time, to be fair. So we should have some time. Do I have wakey wakey? Yes, I do. A shivering blow. Needed that. Well, nobody's in like an awful, an absolutely dire situation. Just blast it. Put it on blast. That was all right. That was all right. Vile cretins. Once again, we will live. Get harvested. Is that stuff I can sell? Well, I might as well keep it. If this is the end of the area, I might as well keep it. I'm also going to try something which someone suggested, um, which is... Ah, oh, to be fair, we don't have any temp weapons to do that with. So I was like, someone did suggest to destroy, like, the temp weapons, if we did have any, just to see if we could then just keep that scrap. But actually, all the weapons we have aren't temp weapons currently. The only person who doesn't have a weapon is Squidward, and I don't think he can have weapons. I don't think peons can carry them. I don't think. Is this the end of it? Is there anything to rummage? Okay. Relatively okay first foray into the hinterlands, I would say. Not too bad, but it was never going to be a super hard one, I guess. It kind of like lulls us into a false sense of security These now. Footpaths now feel a little more familiar. Very nice. Bit of gold. Bit of bone. Yep, bone. That's 27. That's not terrible. Did anybody level get any better? I think my thing is now is, is there a higher than veteran? Is veteran the highest you can get, or can you keep going Let's and get more souls? What the new day I don't quite know. I don't quite know. Oh, that's done. Splendid addition. Fabulous. So the campgrounds is now done, and now it's level two. So there'll be more squatters, and then more life that gets recovered at camp. Yeah, I need a lot. The answer's whole level three. So where was that guy who we helped last time? He doesn't seem to be here. I'm pretty sure his name wasn't Dirk Leaper, Keen Dot Dodder, Slob Warmer, or Wand Reefer. I think like I would have remembered if that was his name. And I don't think it was his name. Um, nothing I really want to sell here right now. I could buy the woods. I, you know what? Go on, I'll buy it. A fair it's only 50 a bit. I might buy another weapon as well, maybe? We don't have bone, but we also don't have bandits or acolytes currently. So it's not like we're using them. I could do with building the... Hunter's Guild, but I'm still five wood off, unfortunately. I don't think I can, because of that, I don't think I can really upgrade. Yeah, wooden fiber. I think wood, lack of wood is going to be a real haha -ha problem. Don't worry, I, I laughed before you did, so don't worry about it. Uh, let's have a look here. Wooden bone again. It's rough going, isn't it? It's really rough going. I don't think I care too much about the larder. I, leather and fiber, great, but I don't, I don't think we need the room. I just, I just don't. So I think that's kind of okay. Quarters is stone and ore, and I think that's the same with the Warrens, maybe? Stone and bone. All right, paint me wrong, I guess. And then the armory is leather and ore. Right, so ore would also be quite handy, but eh. Let me have a quick look at the barracks. Let me see if anyone's higher than veteran. Right, who did we take out there? So Fred is a veteran level three. Three does seem to be the highest. I do want to test it just to see if it does go higher than that. But it does mean we're going to have to take out a few regular Joes, as it were. Age 9, Adventures 11, Battles 20. Yeah, it doesn't really seem to move. Three surely can't be the max, because three souls is... It's okay, but it's not loads, you know? And what do I need? 20. And I've got 14. So if I, like, sacrifice, let's say sacrifice, if I retired three goblins who were... Or two goblins who were level 3, like, if I sacrifice, like, Sir Fred and Sparkworm, for example, then we would have enough souls for it. But I don't know how I feel about that. I don't quite know how I feel about that. You know? We still have those little kids in the Warrens. We do. A hardy Can I actually upgrade Any these guys now? For Chair Lobber and Little Thick. If I turn him into like a, a raider. Okay, apparently I can make Mint Dimmer in. What about Fellcaller? Also, he literally has nothing. I might have to dismiss your child. That feels mean, though. That does feel mean. Suits their yeah, I've got no room. Sorry, I've got no room at the end currently. Tell Mary to go away and piss off somewhere else. Right, well, I guess I'm going to keep out going uh, and get more materials because I can't really work with anything. And I would like to see if we can get to four souls per goblin. At least we can then push it. What's going on here? Oh, we've still got a following through. Let's keep going, man. Okay, this should do. I'm going to keep Sir Fred in because I want to see if he can get to, like, if there is another level above having three souls worth. And that way we can sort of, like, figure it out. Because he's probably the closest to 
actually getting to the next level, if there's a next level. So let's get in there, let's see what happens. Now, I'll say that Gobuta, I also want to test this. Gobuta is going to get a temporary weapon, and at the end of the area, I'm going to try and unequip it and scavenge it, and see if it then gives us scrap for it, and sort of, like, work our way around for that. It's not going to make a massive difference, but someone suggested it, and it sounds like a good idea, if it works like that. We'll see. All right, back here again. I assume the map's going to be a little bit different. Yes, it's a tiny, teeny tiny bit different. Let me have a look in here. I mean, I'll always take a golden scrap. I still need to sell the scrap from before, but that's fine. We can do that when we return. First thing's a shrine. That's fine. With me. Let's see what it, let's see what the offering is. They their ancestors. So healing effects used on party members gain grant an additional 90% life. That's not bad. Magic users in your party increase their magic damage by 30%. I mean, we've only got one magic user, so for the sake of it impacting everyone... Let's go the potent healing. Have been blessed. That way we can utilize it for the all instead of just the one. Makes sense to me. Right, grab that stuff. No Let's keep going. However small is worthless. And a guru, man. It's like this area is getting us ready for something, and I'm a bit I'm a bit concerned. I'm a bit concerned. So B spin arrow, I'm actually gonna do that again, because that was really good. And I feel like we're going to walk into some more beasts, so... And then we'll go... What does Rattle do? Inflict more. Sticky Hoodoo. Hmm. Heals for... I don't know. I don't want to use Salvage. Let's go Rattle. Makes the warrior. Is there a Raider? Come on, give me a Raider one. No, it's not interested, mate. Well, in that case, let's just... This is already going to be powered up now, thanks to that... Um, shrine ability. So let us go... I guess I could go that. Hmm... I've already got it, though. Let's go double shot. Yeah, the Hunter's going to get a serious power-up. Will Piper's going to have the time of his life today. Or, you know, he'll die painfully. There's uh, there's not really any way around it, to be honest. So there's a camp there. There's a smithy. There's a treasure and a harvest. Really, I should go up. I should go up, go up to the tough battle. All right, people, get ready. It's going to be a tough one. But it's at the start of the area, so we, we're not in, like, a bad... Wait. Wait for it. Surprise, there. I think it, mu it must be like a, a maybe, well, they won't, they sort of thing. Oh, it only surprised two of them, though. That's a little weird, but okay. I guess that's all right. Clocked. Right, so Fred, do you have... No, you don't. Doesn't matter, he's going to crit anyway. Nice. What does surprise actually do? It's just being further back on the thing. Okay, fine. These Timberwolves have got a lot of health. Will Piper, have you got anything? So once again, set the trap with 50% chance to activate when the target takes damage. Once activated, it deals 100%. Okay, so it's I drop it on them, and then every time we do damage, standard damage, we can then... Oh, it actually shows us like what abilities are next. Interesting. That didn't used to be a thing. Or I can just go double strike. I didn't really do as much as I would have liked, so... Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Let's just go Slicing Dagger. Let's get it bleeding. Sparkworm is not the one I really wanted up front getting hit by that, but don't worry about it. He could technically life shock himself, but I don't think... What I will do, actually, I'm going to speed up our boy. Make him go nutso. Of all the people to get attacked by the wolves, I guess that's fine. All right, it's it's becoming less fine. I didn't I didn't fully mean it when I said that. All right, chill out. Uh, I could intercept it. I could armor up. I could just bash. I think I will intercept. You're gonna be bleeding for a bit. I don't know how much for, but you do heal every time you attack. So it's not. It could be worse. Sundered as well. Decent enough. God, we're so far back on on, on chopping block. Oh yeah. That's not cool. That was quite a boost, wasn't it? I'm not a fan of that. This could be going better. Okay, stunned at least. God, 13 damage. We are going to need to rest and recuperate after this one. Okay, good crit. Good crit. Will Piper, can you finish the job? I don't think you can. You can come close, though. Okay, die from the poisoning. That's fine. 
Now the problem is these guys. Start the bleeding. And then, little thick, if you could salvage and heal yourself, that will offset the bleeding. There is quite a bit of it. There is quite a bit of it. Now, I could knock them back. I could hex them and slow them down, but it's only... A 50, there's a 50% chance to slow, but they've got 40% resistance, so I don't think it's going to be super handy. But I could try and knock them back. And I will knock them back. Now, little thick, if you want to bash... No stuns this time. Oh my. God, that's a lot of health damage. This is becoming problematic. Right, don't. Don't trap. That's fine, I guess. Uh, wakey wakey would be alright, but just go for the damage. We need to start breaking through now. And hopefully, Sparkworm gets a healer. Heal healing ability, should I say, not healer. Come on, that one's almost dead. Sooner Strike would be good. It's not really a lot of damage, though, is it? Let's go slash. The crit was amazing. That was fantastic. Let's rattle him. Shake, rattle, and roll. Good stuff. Are we going to get a go first? Will Piper will get another go first. If we just chop and kill it. Oh, it's on three health. Bruh. Come on now. Kill it. Okay, that's another one bites of dust. Keep it up. Could be worse. It could be worse. It always could be worse. Slash. Do you have a trap fail? It's a 50-50% chance, but it does seem to fail quite a lot, doesn't it? So I'm noticing. Does it want to... Aha! There we go. It played right into my hands, kind of. Come on, then. Staggering hit. Needed that. Needed that. Right, do I have any live shot that I can just crash into someone? Yes. And then you should get to go and finish it, right? Three, though, is not really... Hmm. Oh, lordy Lou. That was a lot. That was a lot. That was a lot of damage. This is rough. But it's okay. We're okay. I think we're okay. Good. God. It's fruit. Well, uh, the first area is bitter, but its fruit is sweet. of the Hinterlands was perfectly fine. This area is uh, kind of less so. Well, let's keep going. We're okay for now, I think. We do have some injuries, but there are some stuff I can use to heal. So there is that. Let's go talk to the blacksmith, who will hopefully do us a favor. What's up, Smithy boy? They will soon need them. 1% to fail. Surely you can't fail 1%. If you do, I'm calling bullshit. Alright, cool. Rock? 21%. What about that? It's still the same regardless now, is it? Go on, 21%. I've got a 79% chance to pass. Alright. These guys aren't screwing up as much. It's kind of nice. Thank you. I'll be off now. Now, what's next? It's treasure, which is actually what we want. So, I'm all here for it. And then there are some more fights coming up. Uh, foodstuffs, gold bag. Ooh. What is that? Let me open my inventory, please, game. 20% chance to stun. Let me enchant... I've actually got quite a few choices, to be fair. Let's go... Wooden Stall, just because he already has a chance to stun, so it'll just double up. And if you want to... Try and heal up the lads a bit, that'd be quite good. Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to sell it. But... It'll be, at this point, worth it. I don't think I really have a camping event, so there we go. It is what it is. I'm not. I'm not that fussed. I'd rather keep our goblin boys and girls alive more than anything. Now let's see. Two fights and a guru, a shrine down there, another tough battle. I guess for the sake of oh, there is a harvest there though. The choices, the choices to make. I don't know. We'd probably get more stuff from it, but we might also get absolutely eviscerated. I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk it for the harvest. Harvesting surely is the better way of uh, 
finding materials because you get it in bulk. That would be my assumption. I don't actually know if that's how it properly works, but I would assume that is how it works. Oh, man. These wolves are fast. Right, can I possibly stun one? Yes, I can. So, Fred, wakey, wakey. Okay, that was that was big. I needed that. Gak, do you have anything to start? No, you don't. Try and sunder him. Cool. I don't think he's got a lot of armor anyway. Oh my god, Whale Piper, don't die in the first foray, please. It does have double shot. I don't think it's gonna... Do I get to decide who it shoots? Random foes. The answer is no, I don't. Okay, well I guess just chop the red back for now. Uh, this could be... This might be rough going. This might be rough going. But we will... We will persevere, probably. Ah, oh, that kind of sucked. I'm sorry. It kind of did. Okay. Also, the damage increases are insane. We don't... You don't need that. But you guys don't. You don't need that. What's your uh, resistance to? Only 40%. I don't think that's great. I'd rather definitely Spirit Rush one of us. I know that that definitely gives us haste, where the other thing might or might not slow them down. There's no, like, guarantee of it. Uh, are you already gonna get... No, rattle him. Shake, rattle, roll. Come on. Come on, Arcade. Get going. I need to do some Mondo damage here. Alright, 18 is pretty good. It is now gonna take forever to get a go, unfortunately. You are gonna go... Ugh! Dirty move. Absolutely dirty move. Okay, that is also pretty disgusting. Come on, Gak, stay in the fight, will you? You can do it. Maybe. Exceptional skill. Also, Whale Pipe is not looking great. He has seen better days. Now, if it's shot, it would get the kill. Let's just definitely get the kill. Let's just confirm that. Put it in a bank. Okay, so Fred. Our oh, kids. I've already got haste. I don't need haste again. Although it is going to drop soon. Okay, Sundering's okay. You are poisoned. I mean, everyone's poisoned at this point. Uh, Gobbleter, I don't think you're going to be doing much anyway, unfortunately. Yeah, not even like a... Okay. I think it's going to be coming in. Okay, you got there. Can you maybe... How, how stunnable is it? Not very. Although it's only like a 20% chance, so I guess. Stop that. You, you're doing enough... Look, you're doing more than enough damage already. Chill out. Man, that, that increase is quite something. It's quite something. Okay, I can't make them bleed. Full of no money, I can't make them bleed. Uh, right. Chop, chop. Down to 12. You're not looking great, buddy. Gax on 7 health. He, uh, he might die. He might die. But he's not going out without a fight, so he says. Do we have a heal? We don't. We don't have a heal. I could try and slow them both down. And it will work. It will work. It does give us a bit of a chance. Fantastic. Great job, Whale Piper. Great work. Okay. Do I have Intercept? Intercept has not shown up for ages. This is the first time in a while now. Although it is now stunned, so... Gobbleter. It's something. It's something. Oh! One of our boys is down. Gak is Gak is down. Unfortunately so. I will try and heal him up, but man, this has been one big fight after another. Hopefully this is the last big fight we do in this area and there isn't like a, a huge boss that we better have to deal with at the end, because this has been quite something already. We need to get our uh, eugenics program for the goblins in full swing. Although it does seem there's a bit of a limit at the moment. And the genetics that are coming in are not great. Gak, how you doing? Do you want some revenge? He wants some revenge. The taste of victory 
Ooh. Gross, dude. Okay, what, what did you get out of it? Was it worth it? Five and six, and then I get this to do it again? Come in handy. Five and six. It was worth it, it for like the 22 resources, plus while we're in, in all these bags. Meat. All right, Luffy. Um, and then, yeah, gold. Okay, I can at least heal up a bit as well. That's something. But it's not going to do us many favors for anything upcoming. Are there any more fights on this way? Uh, I mean, yeah. <laughs> Short answer, yes. Quite a lot, actually. The healing hasn't really been... This statue tenders a strange oh. gift. Right, come on. See us through. Now, is that permanent or is that temp? Oh! Grows. Oh, burns effects are permanent. Corrupted goblins are lost forever. Corruption chance can be improved at the last quarters. So if I keep going, I might corrupt the goblin and kill Sir Fred. I'm okay. But he's permanently powered up. Does that now mean if I went to, like, Sir Fred, for example? Still three. Still three. Dark power, permanent bonus to power, corrupted shrine. Yeah, I don't know. Doesn't really seem to be doing it for me, you know? I guess we'll see. Well, I've got a few choices here. I can either fight two normal fights or another big fight. I think I'm gonna go for the two normal fights. I'm gonna I'm gonna risk it. Because I think we need a bit of a break from the mental fights. Saying that, these fights could still be mental. Do I have any more healing items? I don't. We're just gonna have to, like, kind of go with it. Oh, God, hello. I was hoping that I wasn't gonna get ambushed then. Okay, two wolves instead of, like, 14 wolves is is something that's okay. Uh, shake, rattle, and roll. Especially when I can stun them like that. Double stun. And unfortunately, I don't think it works like that. But, I'll take it. If we can get through this fight without taking too much damage, then the other one should be alright. Gak is not done. He ain't done yet. Will Piper, do you have the Beast Pain Arrow? Nice, that one's basically gone. Oh, hell. Gobuta, do you want to just uh, finish it? Good job, my guy. Good job, my guy. Okay. Do you have any healing? You have Life Shock. There we go. He may be permanently injured, so we're probably going to have to retire Gak when we get home. But I think it'd be nice to be able to retire him and not have to let him die in the field, you know? So he can be with his, his old friends. Literally his old friends. Uh, bash it. Bash it. And stunned. Now. Okay, there's only chop. I say only chop. It's a lot of damage. Man, that ham hammer is really uh, taking us through the entire game, isn't it? For now. I'm sure the, uh, it'll drop off kind of soonish. Right, Sparkle, what have you got for me? Uh, hex it, see if you can slow it down. And you will. Good job. Gak, do you still want some revenge? He's hanging in there, our kid. He's hanging in there. Props to him, honestly. Right, smack him with a chair. Give him the wooden chair! Right, Will Piper, can you finish it? Man, hunters are great for this area. It's almost like they conveniently appeared at the right time. It's entirely necessary. Right, grab that. It is more healing stuff. I wouldn't mind being able to keep some of it, but we have another battle coming, so I need to go upwards to try and keep everyone going. It's not the end of the day if um, the goblins do die, because we still get their souls and they go out in style. It's just that it would be nice to be able to bring them home, you know? To see their family or something. That'll do. I'm going to try and keep some of it for money's money worth. No, you ain't ambushing me, mate. Okay. Crack on. Crack on. Uh, intercepts that one. Might as well intercept it. Stun it for the time being. Oh, here he comes. Run right to the plate. Still a lot of damage. It's not a small amount, buddy. Right, slap. That's half of it gone. Oh, the fact that it bounces off. And people can... It does seem that people can resist it, at least. So that's nice. But it's kind of too... It, it, it does seem to be kind of dependent, so... Uh, let's go Beast Bane Trap. Let's kill that one. Great stuff. Great stuff. 
Now, are we gonna get... No, but let's give it a try anyway. Nicely. You would have think critting would make it bleed automatically, because it's a crit. I guess not, though. Sparkle will resist that, though. Can you Soul Gale them back? Yeah, kind of. Kind of. Doesn't mean you're gonna get another go up. How is your... Right, Rattling. Not bad. You got a plus five, but you lost two, so generally speaking, that's fine. Uh, let's go double shot. I don't know why it resisted exactly, but that's okay. Uh, let's just go slash. It's summit. Gonna take a bit of a beating, but it's all right. I'm sure he's fine with that. Exterminates, it'll only be a one spot instead of a five spot, because you are gonna kill it, so you should only go back to about here. Perfect. Gak is still on it, I do believe. Never think he's out until the very end. Come on, let's keep it going. All right, Sparkworm, you might as well just hex it. I don't think it's gonna do much of a difference, to be quite honest, but it's fine as it is. Chop, sundered for ready. We're gonna get two more turns where I should be able to do at least a bit of damage to it. Slash. That really doesn't make people bleed as much as it uh, should. So. But it's fine. Right, intercepts. Oh! Here comes the double bite, but that's okay. Because Whale Piper should be able to help us clean off a bit. There's nowhere else it can go to, so that will go into there. Let's see about... Just just hex it. You know what? I don't think we need to heal anymore. I don't think. And then Gak. I mean, might as well do it. I know you're not gonna... You're gonna get all the way back. Oh, he killed it! He crit it! With each victory, God damn! Their okay, I was gonna say it looks like we're relatively safe, but there is actually a boss battle at the end of this area. So all of a sudden, I feel like we're not relatively safe. And our health is now a bit of a problem. But I'm not going to use any of the health stuff right now. I'd rather just get close to the end to see what we find. And then use the health stuff. Was there even like a camp? Oh, there's a camp just before it. Okay, at least the game doesn't screw us that much. I was like, how dare this game make us do all that and not let us camp once. The goal of it. But no, it does let us camp once. So that's alright, I guess. What do I get? Medium adventure stuff. I get a temp wicker shield and then an orb of hunting. Damage. Wow, damage against beasts. Now, if I did that and gave it to, let's say, Whale Piper, I feel like that would actually make his ability go kind of nuts, right? I can't anyway. Okay, well, I guess I put it on Sir Fred. And then, is that going to be better? Is that going to be better than what the one that the little thick has? So, it goes up in that. 20% chance to bleed. I do like the gain 5 life per attack, though. I really like that. So, you know what? I'm keeping the store, man. Let me just dismantle that. Well, it looks like it turns into junk. So, I think I think that person might have been right. I, I've, got a, I've got a sneaking suspicion. I guess we'll see. We'll see. I might need to use the food stuff. We'll see what we look like after the camp. Although, I guess we could use the food stuff before camp, so we heal, and then we can use the camp to get another ability instead. That might work better. I think that might work better, because we are looking like we're flagging a bit. How much does it heal? 20% of life. How many people are injured? 1, 2, 3, 4. I mean, it's it's risky. Yeah, getting 8 back isn't fantastic. I think we're going to have to heal as well as healing items. Oh boy, second area. What can I say? Second area. It's a rough and tumble area. I'm hoping we're really going to have to, like find some better goblins so that we can then put the genes into goblins that go down the road. That is evidently the game of the whole thing, but still. Um, we'll see. Right, here you go. Here you go. And here you go. That's, that's the best I've got. Let's see what this boss battle is all about, eh? Oh, God, here we go. Rough day at the office, indeed. That spider is huge. Oh, God, that makes me uncomfortable. Charge. Ugh. Look how big that thing is, man. Why? It doesn't need to be that big. What do you call Duskweb? Ugh, disgusting. 
I guess, intercept it. I was going to stun it, but unfortunately did not roll with the punches. That was rude. Mate. Mate. Not on. Ho, ho, ho. Ho, ho. So Fred ain't messing. All right, Gak. You need to be careful here. Yeah, okay. That's all right. That's less all right. Calling bullshit game. Ugh. Yeah, we're all, like, quite far back now. Rude. Ah, the, the bounce poison. Not a big fan of the bounce, the bounce poison. So it's only a 20% chance to bleed. You've got a zero chance resistant. It doesn't really seem to do me many favors. Okay. Well, you know what? Let's get you bleeding. How much are you taking? So it's only six over five. Six isn't that great, to be honest. I thought it'd be more. Let's sticky hoodoo them. Never mind. I guess we're not doing that. Really? You're bumping up by four power? Oh my god, game. Do you wanna... Do you wanna screw me anymore? Alright. I take offense to that. Like, a lot of it. Bro. Oh! Resist it! Okay, one, one person resisted. Me! This is now insane. This was fine a second ago. It is it is no longer fine. First foe is slain. Okay. Fred's pasted, although he's probably gonna die if I don't heal him soon. This is nuts so, isn't it? I will say that I am pushing people back. All their abilities seem to send them all the way to the back of the line. And I mean all the way to the back of the line. So it's a bit crap in terms of that. Right, kill one. Eight poison. Jesus. And the fact it's just going to keep going as well. That is... How much are you taking it for? Yeah, you're going to bleed out, man. Okay. I brought in Sir Fred thinking that he was going to be... The one to see if we get up to that level, but he might, he might die. He actually might die. Right, I'm going to have to use some quicker abilities here. Sparkworm, have you got a heal? You do have a heal. That's something. I don't think I'll keep him fully alive, though, but it, it's something. Right, little thick, you've got so much health. You need to do a big hit here. That's not what I needed. The, I mean, the four times damage isn't helping me. To be fair, that's not doing us any favors. Which is kind of rough, but hey, I, I can't really do much about it. God, let me just read this quickly. So, oh, power is increased by four. What if it was times by four? And I was like, are you having a laugh, mate? Well, that's what you get for hurting Sir Fred. I might have to retire Sir Fred. He might not even get there. He's probably going to poison out of this, right? I need to heal him again, technically. This is a little cray-cray. I should say so. Just saying. Does this do anything other than just hitting beasts? Nine-something, I guess. Can you intercept? Why do you... It really does not like giving me the intercept ability. Not a fan. Not a fan of it lately. And I don't have life shock. Which is going to be really, really problematic here. Ah, oh, mate. I think we might see some death here. So, friends! Loss. Yep. We've had another death. So, Fred was like, the G. Are you kidding me? Duskweb, you massive asshole. I mean, it was only a matter of time, I guess. This is not looking funky fresh. Will Piper has only been here for one go as well. I would like to use him a bit more. But at this rate... Finally, a stun ability. Also, you're kind of at the mercy of the cards. Which is a problem in itself. Right, Live Shock Will Piper. I don't want him to get a permanent injury. Let's try and avoid more of those, please. Gak. Please kill it. Oh, Sir Fred. Sir Fred the second coming in? The imposing creature is gone. Hopefully never. Bloody hell. Oh, at least I got some gems for it. 
But at what cost? At what cost? Right, back to it. I'm guessing this is the exit to the hinterlands, I would imagine. Okay. Don't tell me there's another fight. I can't handle another fight. In their oaths, the goblins set foot to path, journeying in the phantom trail of the old orc. What's this? At last, they crest an overlook on the border of the hinterlands. Gasps tear forth from their throats as they gaze upon the sprawl of a prison camp before them. In a crush of bodies, enslaved orcs toil beneath halfling guards, limbs bedecked in irons and shackles. And still yet, the walls of that foul place are besieged by another appalling evil. Hordes of undead fall upon the camp's walls in an onslaught of devastation, enraptured by the chorus of anguish and woe. With hearts longing for a hero and minds weaving vengeance, the goblins look onward as the undead breach the walls. The craven halflings flee to safety, shielding their escape with the prodigious bodies of enslaved orcs left to perish. The orcs fight with resilience, but are soon overwhelmed by the unrelenting advance of the undead. So, the Hinterlands. Bit of a mess, so it seems. I guess that's what you maybe escaped from? Well, that's a problem. Man, on a plus side, that was like the most encounters we've ever had to do in, a f in like a run. So the fact that we even survived that with, with the amount of goblins we had, I guess, is impressive enough. But man, my boy, Sir Fred, my boy. We did get three souls, at least. I'll never find out whether we got four souls. Um, but he did sacrifice himself so that everyone else could survive Gak. I'm also probably going to have to retire. Man. Turns out the Hinterlands is a dangerous place. Who would have thought? The prison camp burns. The orcs are in peril. Save as many orcs as you can. Well, let's maybe focus on saving us first. Can fuel a oh, man. Legion for many right, wow. Well, hang about, hang about, hang about. I feel like I need to... I don't know if it will let me hire more people. Let me go to the merchant quickly. I need to sell stuff in general. Let's get rid of all that stuff. Get rid of that. Uh, get rid of all the scrap. I got rid of the, one of the temporary weapons, it did seem to work, so I guess that is something we can do bug. going forward. Um, I might just be able to buy... What's that? Rock on a stick, nine power. I assume that's better than the regular Joe one. Nine power, nine power. I mean, they've already got it. Although, I suppose that would offset... I don't know. What's that do? Rock on a stick, nine. Hunter... I mean, Thrust looks kind of better than the rock on a stick. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna buy the long stick. I'm gonna see if it's any better. Kind of go from there, really. Um, and there's not really anything else. I they've got slots, which I guess is something, but eh, it's whatever. What do you guys like? Religious. Religious. As I say, the old religious. Bust birder. Okay, none of these are good. None of these are great. You can you just leave it to it. Let me go to the barracks. I think we need to say goodbye to someone else. Unfortunately, where are you, Gak? Oh, Gak, buddy. I'm sorry. I think it's time to go. Off you go. The thing's disappeared again. Where it tells you whether they're going to retire or not. That's a bit buggy as well. Off to retirement, Gek. You did a good job. It does mean, though, we now have 20 souls. Which means I can upgrade this. So I will. 500 gold as well. Upgrade the answer soul lets you delve deeper. Yes, I know. But we barely use, like, even this part. So let's just chill out for a hot minute. What's it now? What do I need to get now? 35 and then 20, having 26 goblins. I was hoping that this upgrading this would then increase the population size. But I think that's to do with the actual barracks. Which I need more wood for. I need 20 wood. How much wood do I have? That's the Raiders Guild, not the Larder. I still only have 10. I still only have 10. Not ideal. Not ideal at all. Do you have any wood on you? I don't think I saw any in the merchant. But I can have a quick gander. Eh, uh, no. No, 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 no. So I've got loads of money. Like, I've got so much money, but I can't really spend it on anything, which is really weird. Wood seems to be the problem with what we need to get. It might be a case that I could do that. But do I, do I really want to? I don't know how much lever and ore I have of each. 
I've got 34 ore, and I've got 52 leather. Okay, you know what? I probably can upgrade the armory. What does it do? Armory storage. Smithy weapons upgrade chance plus 6%. Do I care? I don't know if I do care. What does this do? Retire goblin capacity. Chance to rare shine blessing. This might be better. This might be better. I'm going to upgrade. You know what? I'm going to upgrade the claws. There we go. Uh, it looks a little bit nicer. Looks a little bit nicer. So 17 out of... 7 out of 18. Do I have to, like... Wow, I have to dismiss them when we run out of space. That feels kind of mean. But I mean, I might have to do it. Okay, so I've upgraded a few things. There's a, there's a few areas I would like to build, but I keep sort of running out of stuff, basically. Um, I still just need... I need wood. I might go back and do some areas on my own back, just so I can get some uh, materials from, like, the original area. Orcs in peril. Go rescue the orcs. I mean, it's still money. Yeah... Upgrading the war room is quite a big thing to do as well. So yeah, I might go back to the old woods in my free time and just quickly run around here and get some materials because the hinterlands is just going to keep eating us alive, so it seems. Oh, so the next one is saving the orcs. Yeah, so I'll see what I can do, but I am going to hold it off there for today. We have got quite far in again. We're, we're well into the hinterlands. We have unfortunately lost a friend. We have a lot more permanent weapons. We have upgraded the ancestors' hall as well as doing a few more upgrades here and there. So I think we're in an okay place, and I can now get... 23 to 36, but most of that is because of the retired goblins. But condolences to the ones that we lost today. As always, people, just keep throwing in your goblin names. We've got so many goblins that are going to keep coming in, but I don't think we're ever going to run out of space for naming the goblins. So keep them coming in the comments or in the Discord. Regardless, just keep all the names coming. But as always, if you enjoyed this episode, feel free to check out the rest of the channel. I'm sure there's more of you'll enjoy. Feel free to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you know the next time we're going out with our little goblin pack in Goblin Stone, as well as other games to come. And like I say, feel free to join the Discord and get involved in the conversation in the interim. And also, if you want to name some goblins, whatever you would like, also keep it kind of friendly, you know? Otherwise, ciao for now from me, guys and girls. Ciao for now from the goblins.